Hello, and welcome back to Diamond Shine with Shanta. Today, I would like to do an unboxing. Um, this unboxing is from Diamond Art Club. It is a square kit. We can tell by the blue square and the blue stripe. This kit is called Inner Garden by You May Art. It is 60 centimeters by 90 centimeters, so she is a long one. Let's get into her. I had already um, previously opened this um, when I was showing my Black Friday haul. So it has been opened. It might not have a two. I don't think it has a two key in it. Y'all go drop my stuff and tell y'all if it can be dropped. I'll drop it. So I don't think it has a two key in it. It might. No, no two kits in it, so I can't show you the two kit. Okay, she definitely is going to have to be rolled backwards. Man, she's long. <laughs> I saw on Facebook where Christopher Colossa and Miranda and Maritza are having a you may art event. I, I, I didn't see when the event was, but whatever it is, even if it's in February, I'm going to participate. Man, this was giving me a tough time. Rolling it backwards. I'm going to participate. I love you, May Art. I have a lot of her paintings. I have the majority of them. It's just a few that I don't have. I didn't get transparent. I didn't get muted sounds. Trying to think what else don't I have. I have most of them. I'm a serious you may fan. And again, I'm still I'm having a glare. Uh, let me see if I cut this light off. I was trying to just get more light, but I may have to just cut it off because I think it's causing a lot of the glare problem. Let me see here. I thought I pulled it further back. Let me see if that does that help any. Yeah, that's good. That's a little bit out. Okay, we'll leave it. We'll leave it like that. So again, this is called Inner Garden by You May Art. Let me um, just kind of zoom in and we can look at the canvas details. Let me move this out the way. It is a lot of her color blocking in the background up top up here. It is not my favorite, but I can do it. See, all that is the same color. So you see all that is color blocking. Oh, look at all the color blocking. But it's not as bad as the piano one, so. And then the colors kind of change once you get down here, so that's kind of cool. And then you start seeing the top of her head. You start seeing the beautiful flowers. Look at that, y'all. Look at those pretty flowers. There's her face. And she's like, it's like a skeleton. And then that's her face. I guess it's showing her on the inside, her inner garden. I just, I love it. It's a really dynamic piece. Just beautiful flowers. There's her hand where she's holding herself open. Oh my goodness, y'all. It's so pretty. That is the inside skeleton. 
so pretty. That's, that's her other hand. She has on like a jacket. It's still all down here. The side is color blocking on both sides. That's more for a skeleton. That is the sleeve of her jacket. Look like maybe some buttons. She also has buttons on this side too, I just noticed. And she look like her hair is really long, so like all these are pieces that look, look like to me of her hair streaming down, all of this. So she has very, very, very long hair. Look how long it is. It goes all the way to the bottom of the painting. She has some long hair. And then this is like her pelvic area, her pelvic bones. So pretty. It's a really dynamic piece. It's very interesting. It's even a little bit a little spooky, maybe a little bit. But I still sorry guys. I like it. The colors are just gonna be out of this world. Okay. So let's take a look at the door stuff. I guess a little backwards because of the way it's done, but. Um, it did come with a um, small sticker. Gives you the name of the painting, the artist, the diamond size, and the painting's dimensions. Um, I like to put this in my log book, but a lot of people put it on the side of their box so they, uh, when they store it away, so they know what they have. It also comes with a large sticker sheet that gives you a start and end date if you um, want to mark when you start and when you finish. Gives you a beautiful um, image of the painting. You can see better. See how her hair is flowing around. Just look at look at the flowers. It's so pretty. The buttons. It is. It's so interesting. It's an interesting painting. I love it. All right, this painting. It has looks like. Um, 2AB, it has 60 colors, so it has, um, ooh, four fairy dust, okay, so it has four fairy dust, um, of course, DAC, they use letters, numbers, and symbols, all righty, And then as we kind of look at the canvas, because she's long, um, you do get a legend on the um, top left and the bottom right. The canvas has um, some type of surging and scalloped edges to prevent fraying. Just so, so beautiful. Um, it's also made with a material called tarpaulin, which allows you to roll it back like I did earlier and not damage anything. So let's take a look at her drills. They are labeled in a garden. Just beautiful, beautiful colors. Oh my goodness, I love it. And lots of teals and greens, which I know is my favorite too. I love it. Okay, so let's take a look at the drills. Excuse me for the crinkles. All right guys, so as we look at the drills, before I even get started, I'm just gonna say um, 310, it has um, seven bags of 310. Seven bags of 310. And we also have a lot of bags of 3024, which I bet. No, that's not that color. That must be C. Yeah. So that's the color that's in this bottom part. And then four must be this 
168. Yes. So this color is the color is all the color blocking at the top part. So let me try to zoom in a little bit more. So again, I mentioned we had seven bags of 310. Um, 30, 24, and we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 7 bags. Then we have 168, and we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 bags. And then last but not least, um, 336, it looks like 2 bags. And then that's just more of the 310. And then we have um, 223, um, 321, 322, 3808. Um, this is such a pretty color. I love it. And I get two bags of that. 3810, two bags of that. I'm 939, which is a really pretty dark blue. I, I do like working with two bags of that. 453, 803, two bags of 803. No, three bags of 803, so we get three bags. 3809, another really beautiful teal. And I get, ooh, ooh, three bags of that. And then 312. I'm telling you, I'm going to be in teal and green heaven. This is our first AB. Um, AB stands for Aurora Borealis. It's pretty much a standard drill with an iridescent coating that makes um, the drill shimmer and shine. And it really stands out on your canvas. 948. 699. 3607. 702, 3855. That's really pretty yellow. And that green was, oh my goodness. Oh. 452, our first fairy dust. Hopefully, you can see it has a little mica coating of glitter on the drills. So it gives it a really shite, oh, a little shite. <laughs> gives it a slight shimmer. Our next AB, 103, 160, 991, 3687, 3688. Um, our next fairy dust, oh, that's pretty. See that micro glitter? 758, 754, 700, another beautiful green. 958. 334 and 3861 3712 3810 3740 Thirty-seven, thirteen, four, fourteen, um, thirty-sixty-four, four, fifty-one, two, oh, eight, seven, seventy-five, thirty-eight, sixty-five, thirty-seven, seventy-two, three, nineteen, thirty-seven, forty-six, um, thirty-seven, seventy-eight. Seven, excuse me, 564, 632, 718. That's a real pretty mauve color. Um, our next fairy dust is this um, pretty green. Can you see the mica glitter? I don't think you can see it pretty good. 890, 3706, And our last fairy dust is this pretty purple. Look at that. So beautiful. All right. So let me move these sloppy gifts back so we can kind of see where um, everything goes on the canvas. 
This one's going to be tough. So I think I'm just going to point them out when I see them because it's going to be so much of everything because of these beautiful flowers. I got a feeling that it's all these flowers are just going to be AB and fairy dust to death. But I'm sure it's going to be beautiful. So I want to start up top. Um, we have, again, AB is number one and two, which is that blue and that red. And then our fairy dust, we have four of them, um, which is a pink, a kind of pewter, a light purple, and that green. So let me see. Okay, so already starting out, we have fairy dust, which is Y. I'm going to zoom in a little bit. In her hair right here, it's all that Y. You see is fairy dust in her hair right here. Tell me else that's gonna be something else. Let me see. Do I see anything else? Around that's some more Y up here around the top of her head. Hmm. I don't see anything. Let's look for the for number one and number two. Okay, here is zoom it out just a little bit. Okay, here is some number one. That's um, one of our ABs. It's going to be in this little area right here. On this side. Okay, this um, symbol right here is fairy dust. So zoom in just a little bit. Right here, right here. Make sure you can see them hold, pull it all a little bit right here. All of this is fairy dust here. And that's even almost out of your view. Here. And then as we're coming down a little bit more, it's some here as well. And then that's more one. So that's another A B up in here and here. As I look, um, I also see ones on her skeleton here. These are ones all around her mouth. Okay, fairy dust is, uh, one of the fairy dust is the pink, which is the plus symbol that is in her mouth. Get a lot of the plus symbol. And then this area is just, um, has a lot of plus symbol all up through here. Also, a lot of um, plus symbol is all in these flowers up through here. So, it's a plus symbol. Then if I kind of look here, we got plus symbol kind of just scattered throughout the flowers. Look, see, it's so much. So, that's going to be a lot of um, beautiful fairy dust. And then for our AB, it's, our next AB is number two, and I'm seeing it in these um, red flowers right here that she's holding. Um, it's got twos all in it. So that's going to have red AB. And then um, it's going to be red AB in um, this flower. A little bit in this one. I wonder, is it, did I, yes, I did. I missed some up here. It has red AB right up through here. Let's see what else. We have more fairy dust um, over here. All up through here. It's just fairy dust town. And is the Y over here too? Let me make sure I'm not missing the Y, y'all. Okay, this is the Y. That's like she has in her hair. So this is more of her hair, so it's more Y. It looks like the so far, the Y is mostly confined to her hair. Because, like, it's some. I don't know. I'm sorry. That's not why. Let's see. Yeah, it's pretty much. The Y is pretty much confined to her hair. So, I'm not seeing it in, in this area in the mask or anywhere. Okay. 
Okay, let me see. Am I missing anything else? Okay, here is um, some more of the um, pink fairy dust up in here and here. And then let's look for the W. I'm sure it's going to be in this bright area. Sorry, guys. So right here is W. It's this kind of line block throughout the greenery in her chest. If I roll it over a little bit this way, that's a big splotch of green there. All up through here. Green, green, green. Here. Oh, you can't see that. Roll it down, Shanta. Roll it down. This is going to be so beautiful, guys. It, the brightness of it. Oh, my goodness. Oh, I'm trying to decide what to do for the event. I'm, I want to do a big one. And this one is another really serious contender. This one is a piano. I don't know. I really think I like this one. I'm going to go down here in her body and see if I see any of the fairy dust. Oh, not her body, I guess. Her, well, it is her body, but it's her skeleton. I don't see it at the very bottom. So, it's mainly right here highlighting areas in the center. And that's really it for that green AB. That big spot I show. Oh, it's a little bit right here. Right up here. But yeah, it's that's pretty much it for the green the green fairy dust. So that I bet it's a lot more of these blues though. So let's look at her body of her skeleton down here for the fairy dust, because I bet it's a lot of it. Let me see. Yeah, here is the one A B um right here at the very bottom. Um as I come across, it's a 1AB here, here, here. Um, let's see here. Is there any of the, all oh, this is 1AB up through here. I was trying to see. It's a few W's right here, too, that I think I missed. I was trying to see if it's any of the Y or the other symbol, but I don't see it down here. So I think it's just, here's a, some more 1AB. I think it's all um, 1AB in this area. I'm shocked there's not more in this. Okay, here's some Y. Okay, I found Y. So um, right here, going up, up this little area right here, right here. Let me see anywhere else. Hmm. Yeah, I don't see anymore. All right, guys. Yeah, I don't see anymore. It's mainly all up in those flowers and in her hair and Oh, she's so pretty. Okay, guys. She is called Inner Garden by Yume Art, one of my favorite artists. I just I, I think this paint is so dynamic. It makes you think. And I can't wait to when I actually diamond paint it and stuff is gonna start popping alive. I, I'm sure I'm missing because this is I miss stuff for, for whatever reason. I just think she's so beautiful. She is big, but that's okay. She's going to be worth it. Well, all right, guys. That is all I have today. I am going to um, link um, in the garden in my description box below. I do not think it's discontinued. It may be on the wait list. Um, but if you want to get her, I'll put the link in the description box. Um, I would like to thank everyone for taking the time out of their day um, to watch my video. I really do appreciate it. I hope everyone is having a great day today. And I will catch you guys in my next one. Bye.